What do you mean confirm? Oh yeah. Produce the monster hunter. Let me look at this guy. 55 health and uh, 13 and 10 with a crossbow, that's shit. And uh, 12, 9. It's like a very inferior tier 2. It's like... Mm, not not the best tier 2 ever, let's just say. Enter. There's still a glitch in your green screen? What do you mean? Oh yeah, it is slightly not lighted enough, I think. I'm not sure. Or is it a piece of terrain that's... Hmm. Interesting. I don't see any glitch in my green screen. Um, what do you mean? Ido, see you later, man. Thanks for coming by. With all of the advice. All of it. Click. What is what is this? This is a tier 3 tier 3... Oh, God. I'm boned, aren't I? Yeah. I'm boned. I should have seen it before I moved my hero, and then I would have death marched to that location. Click. If I lose this town, it's over. I got only one town left. It's just not gonna happen. I cannot death march actually because I cast the militia spell. So never mind about that. Ah, uh, but if I could death march, I would save it. Maybe if I spam click next turn, I could walk there before he attacks me. Mm, lame, lame, lame. I can't defend this. From tier 3 units. Shock Trooper. I think he can climb or something anyway. Yeah, wall climbing. Yeah, never mind, never mind. Boned. I just lost. Phalanx. Oh, that is a good one. That is actually something I really want. Should have used the death march better. There's a white stripe in the left corner, top left corner. White stripe. I don't see it. I honestly do not. Oh, I was supposed to spam click. What am I? Why are they backing off? Wow, that is nice. Okay. Click. So I have a full garrison now. Click. Click. Oh. oh why, why didn't they kill me? Weird. I thought the, the, the stormtrooper himself would just kill everyone, I think. Now I got reinforcements there with the uh, monster hunters, it could be actually okay. Probable victory, you say? Mm, it's a decent army. It's gone now, it's back, what? Move your screen over a dark part, and you can clearly see it. If it's... I mean, my arm is missing, I know, but that's not really a bug or anything wrong with the settings. It's just that my green screen is too small. It's just that I'm sitting too close to my camera. Can't really fix that unless I sit like this, I guess. There is no white strip, though. Or it... No, it, there isn't. There is no white strip. But if I sit farther away, then it looks better. 
I should get into a habit of sitting so far away from the camera. It's just that I always unconsciously move myself closer all the time. I guess maybe I'd have too small of a monitor then. Yeah, I have too small of a monitor. There is no stripe. You're just messing with me. That's a lot of draconians. I wish I had some AoE explosive attack. It doesn't look very friendly over here, let's just say. Click. Click. Home. Home. Click. Oh, so she's an elf! She gets no ranged penalty. Nice. Click. Boom. Ah, damn it. Click. Just a little bit out of range. There is no range penalty. Click. So why did I cast the Seeker spell all the time? Silly. Boom. Click. Boom. Now this is a range penalty. Click. So do I continue just trying to kill this guy? I've got one spearman and one razor bow. I guess if my razor bow can take a shot, but then my razor bow will just die? No, my razor bow can survive one melee attack. So if I move in here, shoot a short bow in here. No, that's like no damage at all. This damage just does not exist. Let's just back off. I mean, they can still attack him. Ah, oh, shit. Boom. 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 Bad positioning. Click. But let's put the greatsword in front if I can, at least as much as I can. Boom. Click. I shouldn't stand so close together. They are draconians. They have fire bombs. They have area of effect. Oh, this could go bad. This could go real bad. Let's see how it goes. Maybe they don't have those bombers. Yeah, yeah. Okay, only two of mine got hit. Sure. Oh, my archer's dead. Ah, oh, already. Already. Why would I lie about a white stripe on my webcam? <laughs> <laughs> Why would there be a white stripe? I don't know. I, I just every time I look on the preview screen, just isn't there. Just isn't. Oh, I'm already moving closer. But it's just I just never see it when I look. Charger, crusher, charger. Not the best thing ever, but well I already lost a unit and this will not be a an easy battle. I got it, but it's it's not easy. So I kinda would prefer to kill both raptors, because I think they have more attack value, yeah. They have 12 to those guys is 11. And also they have less HP. Click. So with a spearman... Click. Seriously? Click. Click. Okay, that's guaranteed. Just needed a guarantee. Click. And then shoot with my ranged and finish it off with my melee hero. Put blocks under the wheels of my chair. What kind of blocks? What do you mean? I don't I don't know how to construct this thing. What? How do I Like so the chair doesn't move at all? 
Hmm. <laughs> that would be funny. I'll just make those movements all the time, and then it just wouldn't work, but I'll just keep making them subconsciously. Click. 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 So let's just flank this guy. Finish him off. And then I can still take a shot with the Hingrid. Um, click. But it's not gonna kill. But then my greatsword can kill. That's good, that's good. Oh, actually it did kill, wow. So do I wanna engage my greatsword? Yeah, it's way more damage than they are dealing to me. Actually, I have a chance of killing him. Click. And if not, maybe they will cast a bomb that will kill him. I don't know if they cast it wrong. Nope, it didn't kill him. Had a chance. So I think my greatsword will now die. Ah, they casted the bomb properly. Yeah, my greatsword will now die. So I'll have to replace these units with monster hunters after this battle is done, but I will have a city. It's, I think it's worth it. Brahans, Polymurphs, Wheel Chalk. Come. Come. Click. Come. I guess it's pretty straightforward from now on. I lost the units. Now I'll just finish them off. Maybe if I played it better, I would have saved my Razor Bow, but I don't know, honestly. Yeah, I maybe would have saved my Razor Bow. Absorbed more damage with the heroes. Could have, could have maybe done it better. Actually, maybe I want to back off my Spearmen. Nah, they're fine. Especially with the healing now. The AI will handle it. From now on... There isn't really much more to mess up. Yeah, it looks way better. Now that I look at the previous screen, it looks way better when I'm uh, farther away from the camera. I think I just need to buy a better monitor, because I'm subconsciously moving forward, because the monitor is just too small. It's like a 19 inch, I think. Okay, lost two units. The third one leveled up. And the city is mine. Absorb it! Wait, what? That is one big city! Migrate five, I mean, absorb five turns. Or it can migrate it to orcs. It is an act of evil, but... It will take one turn instead of five. But then, if I do it... It doesn't tell me here. Guys, please tell me, if I migrate, will the city lose its range, its size, its population, and I'll have to start from scratch, or will it keep the population intact? How much population will I have when I migrate? Will I lose the population? I think I will, because migration basically uh, kills the population and then brings the orcs in here. So I guess I'll just be at this really small town that doesn't really get too many benefits. Do you guys know? I've never done it before, I've never migrated. Always absorbed. Go for a 27 to 30 monitor for burst results of viewing versus eyesight distance. That big, you're sure? That seems too big. That seems way too big. Or maybe I have a 22 and it's not that big, what you're saying. That seems too big. I mean, in some games, I will need to catch the entire screen with my peripheral vision, otherwise it would be quite uncomfortable. Like, I played League of Legends once on my friend's large monitor, and I, would, it, I was playing so bad, 
because it was just too big and I had to... I didn't see what was happening on the other edge of the screen. I wish it would just say on the monitor, it was just pasted somewhere on the monitor, how big is it? Because I just forgot. I don't know how big is it, so I don't know how much bigger I want. I don't know if it's a 19 or a 23. So you guys don't tell me anything about the migration. Maybe I should just then not do it, just play it safe. Mm. It doesn't really say. Abs citizen domain garrison independent city occupied city race. It doesn't say anything about population. I need Idoquedo here again. God damn it. Okay. Uh, let's. I mean, it wouldn't make any sense in terms of balance to absorb it for five turns or migrate for one turn. Oh, but it... it oh, no, it takes uh, a number of turns depending on the difference between the alignment. Alignment. So it doesn't depend on population. So if I migrate it, should be fine. I thought it was five turns because it's a big city. But no, it's five turns because it's a city with evil alignment and I am good. But then I guess after I migrate, I'm gonna be evil. <laughs> uh, yes, migrate it to orcs. I'd rather have orcs than dwarves, I think. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. Click. And then let's take out these ruins here. I can. Click. With a bunch of monster hunters, I totally can. Click. Let's send this guy to garrison this city. There needs to be something in it. Oh, and I have a bunch of upgrades, because it was a pretty hard fight. I guess I deserve them. So the leader could be a field medic, regenerates six each turn, but it's not really on the field. It's kind of deceiving, because I would think that maybe it's inside combat, but no, no, no. Charge command. All, all units get charge. Hmm. Could be nice, could be pretty decent. I want this though. Overwhelm, so good. First strike, also pretty good. Mm, really nice abilities. And then Hilda is leveling up for the first time, I believe, so... Oh, she's a druid too? I got two druids! So I'll just upgrade her basic stats. And then let's select some productions, because I have a lot of money, actually. Let's produce everywhere. Um, stone wall, I think, here, because it's... It's basically my uh, high... It's the outpost that stands against the might of the Red Empire. So I want good walls in there. Also, it's gonna increase the range of the town as well. Here I'm just making units, and here I'm absorbing. So I, I don't really have anything to spend my money on. Uh... I was thinking about dropping an outpost here, but then I... These mines are still protected by neutrals. Enter. Runak has a quest. What is the quest? Feed the hungry. What? Oh, oh yeah, even if I have to feed the hungry, it still involves killing shit. And that's pretty good rewards, too. I mean, I, I get a flyer, I get the town, some money, but it's hard. I think it's something worthy of my hero's attention. I think it, I'm just gonna go there with my hero. What is this? She wants to settle there here. There as well. 
Very likely defeat. Oh, 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 she has an escort. Never mind. Forget I ever asked. Click. Let's just hide within the borders of my ally and then die from these. Wait, is this what I'm supposed to kill? Are you shitting me in the face? Kill the horn god. Uh, I should have never taken this quest. Uh, of course it's 16 by 9. It's widescreen. Otherwise it would mess up the entire screen composition if you see black bars, yeah. I can't kill a horn god! It's impossible! You've seen what happened in that campaign mission. Horn gods do not die. They just kill. It's what they do. Eyesight is getting worse? No, my eyesight is fine. It's just when I sit so far away, well, I sit too far away. And then there's the, the matter of my starvation. I'm actually starving right now, but... I'm really hungry, so I'm lightheaded. So, I, yeah, I see worse than normal, but... It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> now there's the tier 2 unicorn. The rest of them is tier 1. But how am I supposed to fight a horned god? Seriously. I mean, that thing will just take everyone on in melee. And he has so much resistance. 16 resistance. So uh, my uh, my shots, my archers will not do much either. Damn. And I got my hopes up. I should just pay them money, you know. Instead of this quest. Click. Click. Very likely victory. Let's see if I can do it without losses automatically, but probably not because there's a tier 3 beetle over there. Yup, lost someone, let's just uh, do it manually then. Well, the thing is, Emi, I'm, I'm sick today, I'm sick in my stomach, I can't really eat or something. Or, then I will have stomach pains instead of starvation. It's basically a resource management game today. I can either starve or I can uh, have my stomach hurt. And I, I try to be somewhere in the middle. I think I'm on the uh, starvation side of things at the moment. But mostly, it's not the easy. It's not. It's not the easiest day I've ever lived through. But I'm, it's, live streaming helps because I can focus on the game. I can focus on being with you rather than just how I feel. Hmm. Oh, and the. The terrain is actually okay, because uh, they had to walk around, they're not as close to me as possible, and I will be able to shoot the beetle, I think. I think I'll be able to shoot the beetle down. With all these monster hunters, I mean... Click. They're supposed to be professionals, right? Click. No. Wrong. Click. Five to seven. Click. It's actually pretty damn low. Click. Click. Number six. Click. Nice to hear, though, that you're not going anywhere. Click. I'm glad. Number five. Click. Yeah, I can shoot him. I can shoot him and then I can charge him. And he shouldn't really be able to do anything. Click. Click. Um. Um. 
Click. Got him. So how did the AI F it up? How do you lose a unit here? You just kill the Biddle and then... How does the AI still lose a unit? Looks completely fine. My hero just deals so much damage. My main hero is turning like a, turning into a horned god of his own. Maybe I can take on this horned god with my heroes. Maybe they are. <laughs> Maybe my heroes are strong enough to kill one horned god. But then he's got escort of five other units that could... Ah, nah, I can't do it. I can't do that quest. Not with this. Not with this. I got a Hellhound mount. Well, thank you. Let's take the Hellhound on my main hero, because it's better. And then on my secondary hero, take the Unicorn. It's a dwarf riding a unicorn now! Wait, what? I have a fourth hero. How nice, Ramona the Saboteur. Dreadnought wants to join me. I accept, because I have a lot of money, and nothing to do with it. Click. So, Ramona, you will just stand here, build yourself an army of monster hunters or whatever, Berserkers and uh, whatever else I research. What do you mean it's rebelling? <gasps> okay, so from migration, I didn't lose the size, but they got pretty damn unhappy. So if I just walk off with my main hero, I could lose the city to rebels. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Double clack. Ah, but then I'm gonna lose happiness if I... If I rush it. So let's get great swords there. Clack. Let's get that hero there. And let's do the... Um, raise militia there. And uh, I think I can uh, put together an army that will hold that location. And then I got the quarry, so my main town will have more production. If I want to tech up, it will help out. And uh, I'm supposed to go fight the Horned God? Damn, I feel like I have to try! Oh. Improve my hit points to 8200. 8, Why do you think hit points are so important? Maybe? Maybe? You think? Because it's not just hit points. His resistance is ridiculous to physical damage. And his damage itself is ridiculous too. Are you saying I should get everything to its level or...? Slay the Rebels Lord, Vader. <laughs> Nah. The Rebel's Lord will be slain by my auxiliary forces, it's fine. Actually, I can get a Mounted Archer, which is just statistically way better than the... Okay, let's mix them up. Mounted Archers and the uh, Orc Monster Hunters. Let's mix them up. I mean, I've got so much, actually. Up so many upgrades here. Double clack. Double clack. Double clack. Oh. Oh. It's so much power. Double clack. Double clack. If I boost my ranged strength now, 
Maybe I will be able to burn him down with my arrows, who knows. I mean, if I get that, I will get a bunch of good draconian forces, I will get a big town. It could all change for me. And before actually I get invaded by tier 3s of the red player and everything goes to shit. It's very much possible, actually. Enter. 